Hi everyone, this is definitely a case for the Herodontics pile, but because of various medical complications with this patient, um, we are going to see if these two lower incisors are savable. What the thought process was here when this bridge was originally done, I don't even want to try and guess. The teeth are not root treated, they could be fractured, I've pre-warned the patient that we just really don't know what we're going to find here. but. We need to just take the bridge off and see if root treatment and posts are possible or are we going to have to revert to extractions and possibly a longer span bridge. So I'm just going to let the rest of this footage play through. If I try and voice over this whole video it will be far too long. But essentially what we're running through here is dismantling the bridge, removing the posts, making sure the teeth are viable and then building up some cores, doing a quick sort of rough BOPT style preparation, vertical preparation, whatever you want to call it, uh, and then making a temporary bridge. Please remember though when you're watching this, everything about this case is compromised. And I think that's partly why it's a, a useful case to post. Not everything is going to look as picture perfect as cases on Instagram might lead us to believe. Um, the main thing I would have liked to improve about this case would have been some way of dealing with the metal shrapnel coming off uh, the bridge when I was using those carbide burrs. I've never tried a split rubber dam for lower anteriors. I've done it for upper anteriors before. Um, but if you've used a split rubber dam for lower anteriors before, please get in touch and let me know how you found that. Uh, that would be really interesting to know. Anyway, I'll leave you to it, guys. I hope some of this is helpful. Cheers.